Hey, welcome back to Skies of Arcadia Legends, folks. Now, you may have noticed that we're not exactly in Valua. And you may have noticed we're staring at a ship. Decided that now that we have the ability to go above and below the clouds and I can move around the place quickly, I'd head back to Sailor's Island and catch up on some stuff. Um, handed in some moonfish, sold some items. And now it's time to go and face Piastle. There's four encounters with her throughout the game. This one is probably going to be quite easy because this might be the first one and you're supposed to do it way earlier on when you first get the black spot. And now, oh no, she's not wearing an awful lot. Uh, but we are considerably higher level than before. You're so glib. On guard. Yeah, you fight her after your first uh, first encounter in Valua. As usual, the usual strategy. Take out the. Uh, Take out the support act. I'm not entirely sure if she has any magic. We'll use that just in case. You can guard. You can have a stab at Piastri. She still does a fair bit of damage. We also do a fair bit of damage now. That does quite a bit of damage. Still. Uh... Bye, doggy. Somewhere. There we go. That's for you. Nice. Oh, I am very glad that I uh, I blocked magic. I imagine coming up against her when you're half the level that we are now. now this would, this would be a lot more difficult. Ouch. I didn't like that one bit. Alright, Vice liked it even less. Should probably cast Ingram on Vice at some point, but uh, I like the idea of him using Pirate, of uh, keeping my magic shield up.
Well, I made an error. Sorry. I forgot to put my magic shield up. Let's try this. Derp. Risen crystals. Rizalum. Yes. Delta shield. Guard. Let's get Enrique back on his feet. Damn, not a bad crit. You can see why she's called the Angel of Death. Here goes. It really did. Ah, oh, I can't get you to use the judgment. Oh well, Royal Blade's probably a good bet. God, she likes using Tempest Dance. Ouch. Bye bye, Piastel. Or die. That was a close one. It really wasn't that close. Let's be honest. Hey, it's a nice little bit of experience. She obviously has a uh, a grudge against Vice. Let's uh get some healing done. Now, if we go back to. Um, Sailor's Island, to talk to the Guildmaster, he'll have another uh, black spot for us. But let's not do that, shall we? Why don't we go... of the skies, again. I think southeast is where I said I wanted to go. Yes, yeah, southeast, over the Dark Rift. I uh, also got Lawrence on my team. I decided to pay him the 10,000 gold, seeing as we were rich. This just makes sailing so much easier now that we can go above and below the clouds, doesn't it? Ooh, there is some. St I remember there being some stuff around here I wanted to find, actually. Uh, that's Pirate Isle and Shrine Island, so I think it's around here. We just head south to Pirate Isle. I need another eight discoveries to be able to recruit Domingo. Okay, and uh, this way. Yeah, there's that waterfall. There it is. Oh, hello, weird jellyfish things. Let's grab a few of you first. Moonstone Lake. Oh, 
Now, I don't know if the bottom bit is another uh, discovery. This is below the clouds, I believe. Come on. Get off whatever piece of land you're stuck on. Yep. That's what it looks like below the clouds. Uh, it's, not a, it's not an extra discovery. Okay. Back up we go. Make sure we're heading the right direction. We want to go east southeast. Look at me knowing all my compass points. Hello, South Ocean. You will not be a pain in my jacksie anymore. Sky is getting very dark. Must be over the dark rift soon. Yep. Getting close. There's the dark rift. This is the easy way to get over the dark rift. If I get through it, go over it. There is something I wish to find. Uh, when I played this on the Dreamcast version, this was a this was a piece of downloadable content. It was one of the earliest pieces of downloadable content ever. Um, a little add-on for the game. Hamachu Island. And when I went here, it drove my birds ballistic. But look at how cute this place is. And of course, there's a charm around here somewhere. I just need to find it. Is. Quite difficult to find because of all the uh, <laughs> all the hammerchews that you can talk to. Do you notice them? Do you notice anything about them? It's that same bird that we uh, that we're feeding stuff to. Oh. He will then give you stats on what you find. This guy is just weird. But yeah, you can come here and get stats about the battles you fought and the stuff you find. Let's get out of here. Let's go. Let's get to Valua. We'll get down below the clouds soon enough. I'm not going to spend all day up here. It's easy to get into a habit now of not going and getting into any fights and losing out on valuable experience this way. So I want to make sure I don't do that. But there is someone else I want to get. We can get another crew member. I think he's in the skies above Northern Valua. We may have even have been to him already, actually. And um, we just didn't, uh, we weren't able to, to recruit him at the time. 
when we first went to the Mall of Tartus. You, there's, you'd think they'd build something else there, you know, instead of just one village. But that's a lot of island for just one village. God, this ship cuts a very fine shape, doesn't it? Let's have another look at where we are. He has bare north now. Obviously, we want to be below Valua, as opposed to above. But here we'll do for now to get to where we need to go. It's massive quicker. Pretty much as high as I can go. Oh, wrong menu. I think I'm in the right place. Yeah. Oh no, that's just a random rock. There's nothing there, is there? Oh, there is. The Philosophy Stone. There's another discovery. Okay, so I think he's right above this. Or, no. <laughs> there he is. Obviously, we've not been to his house before. I must be thinking of something else. I know we've been to Ryu Cans twice. There's also a charm in here. Finding a lot of places with charms. Hello, Alchemist. Twice. Huh. How weird. I thought he would join our crew now. I probably need to go and then come back how these things work, isn't it? And I have the same problem with another crew member. Jerusalem. There were some very strange uh, requirements for joining our crew. We need a doctor, not an artisan. Let's have a look at our crew. So yeah, we're only missing one lookout. I'm not entirely sure who. Never use the crew attack in battle anyway. I'm only looking out for good passive effects. Right, well, quickly plunge down to the depths. To underneath Valua. I think we're heading the right way, south. Yep, pretty much where we want to be. 
make sure we have underneath the Maw of Tartus because I'm feeling that's this specific area. Pretty much just need to roam around here for a bit until we find it. Oh, hello. The dancing lights. Ah, oh, that's nice. I'm not a betting man, but. This looks like there's something, there should be something on it. Yep. Falloon wreckage. It's not really, it doesn't really look like much of a flagship, does it? That looks like it could be where we want to go, but if I remember right, there is something down here to discover. Yep. <laughs> there you go. Rabbits that hang upside down. Yep, you're not the only one seeing that, folks. <laughs> Do not adjust your sets. Anyway. The, uh, the maw is in here. This is where we want to go. Time for another ship dungeon. Mm. I'm just having a much needed drink. My throat's so dry. Ah. Now this is. Nowhere near as painful to traverse as the Dark Rift. And I have a pretty good bearing on the layout. Looks good. At least we can see things. Uh, if you come across any glowing yellow crystals, they have items in them. As we come out into the next fork, I think there's one to the right, which is a useless item. Can I cut with fury something? These are taking a lot of HP. Delta shield. I think that's the best way to do it. Some of these things have a lot of HP, some of them don't. I'm not entirely sure which way around it is. Oh, you missed, Monstrum. Okay, they don't have a huge amount of HP. Yeah, it's worth having a shot at them anyway. Monstrums don't have a huge amount of HP, but enough to survive Fina. Okay. I should have had him make an attack that other monstrum, but okay, whatever. Still news, you missed. Okay, so I guess it's not so much a super move as it is just a regular attack. You keep that up. You keep. You do that. You do that. Don't want any of these guys casting magic on me randomly. Yeah. These guys can get taken out in one hit. Can 
guess I probably have 400 HP. Probably a good bet. Rex casting Sacrage on itself. Sigh. And we missed. I'm going to have Enrique cast a judgment on it. Because it's nice to see what these attacks do, isn't it? Let's play this animation right. Please don't counter. Go! He takes him to the Coliseum for a beheading. Hello! Ain't no kill like overkill. That was easy. Yeah. Probably switch someone to purple. Are we still trying to learn a lot of red advice? I think we are. These. The ones that are just flat yellow don't have anything in them. These, on the other hand, do have something in them, I believe. Nope, those ones don't. Okay. So to the right, I believe, is an item. So let's go get it. I don't think it's a particularly important item, but you know, it could come in handy wherever it is. Well, we'll take these guys out first, whoever they are. Ah, oh, they're taking us by surprise. She's fatigued and won't recover spirit. Thank you. Excellent. Swords. Delta shield. We'll finish this off pretty quickly. I mean, considering these things only have a few hundred health, knowing Sacris is a uh, much, don't you think? I know, let's heal the guy that's been healed. Doesn't matter. Rain of Swords. An utter victory. Okay, everyone's close to learning purple magic. So, maybe we'll switch someone to purple for the next fight. The only downside about this place is a dungeon. Oh, oh no, we took the uh, took the correct path, I think. Is it's just it's so long, and you have so many enemies to fight. Oh, hello. Yes. <laughs> I see. Interesting. Let's 
Got some shrimp. Feeling Enrique may need to assist on this. Yeah, these guys have a lot of HP. Incremous. Yes, that is a spell I wish to know. Does have uh... Oh, come on, really? <sighs> Little winds would be nice, actually. some of these guys. <sighs> Just have been guarding. Oh, really? I suppose, oh yeah, with, uh, whatchamacallit, Incremon. That makes sense. Hasn't done much at all the last couple of times we've seen it. Rain of Swords would be handy here, I think. Not, but we'll uh, go for the last three. I want to make sure we can have Delta Shield. Finally get one of them taken down. Let's try this. Nicely, thank you. Missed. Again, it's just not doing anything. Bit. Nice. That's what we needed. I hope you go. Hope you go first. Or hope you go before Vice goes. At least. Damn it. What's the matter? Not feeling so brave anymore. Yeah. How you like me now? We keep that up. I don't want to. Don't want them using drill nuts on us. More like it for damage. Over there. <laughs> KO'd by Fina. 
We are victorious. We are. <laughs> I think that's the first time I've heard that one. Well, we'll uh, we'll heal up. Uh, what what's left to be healed? Not a huge amount, really. Just Enrique. And uh, seems like a very good place to leave it off. So we'll see you next time on Skies of Arcadia Legends. Thanks very much for watching, folks. Good night.